Hey everyone, Itai Manero here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to use my Character Designer Toolkit for Procreate, Photoshop, Clip Studio Paint, or any other art software of your choice to create interesting character designs in no time. So let's jump right into it. In order to achieve this, we are going to need the Manero Brushes Character Designer Toolkit. You can find it along with a free mini version for you to try out on my Gumroad page through the link in the description below. You can also save 20% when getting the Character Designer Mega Bundle that also includes the Comic Book Artist Brush Set for Procreate. It's important to notice that this toolkit is not exclusive for Procreate. The way this works is that in Procreate it is available as brushes while you can still use it with any other drawing program of your choice because all the shapes and body parts are also included as image files that you can add to your canvas and manipulate. For the purpose of this demonstration, I'm going to be using the brushes version in Procreate. This toolkit is divided in four different brush sets. A brush set for the heads, another for the bodies, another for the arms, and the last one for the legs. There are 130 different shapes and body parts included so far, and I plan on continue expanding it with future updates that will be entirely free for all previous customers. The way these shapes work is exactly as you would expect. When using the brush version, you can adjust the size before placing the shape in the canvas. Once the shape is in place, you can use the transform tool to flip it, two fingers inside the transform box to move and rotate, and so on. There are 30 different head shapes at the moment that will give you a huge variety. You can see some examples of them on screen. There are 40 different body shapes. You can see some of them here. The same goes for the arms, with 30 different versions to choose from. And finally, there are 30 different pairs of legs as well. Another interesting feature of these brushes is that you can use them in full opacity, or use the opacity preset to quickly change the opacity to an 80%. By doing this, the shapes will now overlap and you will be able to see each shape better, which can be very useful when designing characters. Let's now have a look at how we can use all these shapes together to create a quick exploration for some characters. The cool thing about this toolkit is how easy and fun it is to use. It is very similar to a construction game for kids, where you just grab pieces and play with them while putting them together to build something. You can see how I'm adding shapes, and just moving them, rotating them, changing their size. In a matter of a couple of minutes, we have the first base for a character. I'm going to follow the same steps to create the base for three more characters.
once you have the base for your characters, you can use any brushes of your choice to complete your designs. I'm going to be using the Bold Comics brush that is included with the Comic Book Artist brush set that you can get with the Character Designer Mega Bundle. And just like that, I'm going to start inking on top of these shapes and giving form to the first character. What I really like about this approach is that using this toolkit to create characters feels very much like looking at clouds and trying to imagine what they look like. Playing with interesting shapes and silhouettes will truly help you think outside the box and boost your creativity. You should use these bases as an inspiration for your creation. You don't need to follow the shapes exactly, you can deviate from them as much as you want. They are here to give your creativity a nice push. You don't have to limit yourself to just outline the shapes as they are. Definitely allow yourself to enjoy the process and add as many extra details as you want, like clothes, antennas, accessories, anything. I'm going to leave you now with the time lapse to show you what I did with the other characters. Enjoy! And this is the final result. I really hope you liked this video. If you use my brushes and post your art on social media, feel free to use the hashtag Manero Brushes so that I can see what you create. I will be extremely happy to share your creations with my audience. Don't forget to subscribe for more art related videos and give me a thumbs up. Also, make sure to check out my Gumroad page, where you will find the Manero Brushes Character Designer Toolkit, and many other sets that I have available, I'm sure something will suit your artistic needs. All the links are in the description below. Okay, thank you for watching, see you next time.